hi and welcome to my channel today I'm gonna show you how to um, put an eye and mouth to the little virus um, the pattern uh, I, I used to create this virus is the same pattern I used in my old videos you're gonna find the link to the PDF file in my Etsy shop under the video in the description box so it's simply you're gonna use the same steps to create this virus here but as you can see here instead of putting five sp spikes in the middle row over here in, in the old video I, I showed you how to put the five spikes on top in the middle and in the bottom of the virus body in here instead of putting five spikes in the middle row we're gonna just put three spikes and replace the other two with the eyes and then to the mouth so as you can see here one two and three and instead of these two spikes I added the eyes so it's gonna be something like this and then we're gonna add one spike here one spike here and then one spike in the back I'm gonna go through, uh, through this step by step with you in this video so stay tuned to start you you need of course a needle and a red thread scissor safety eyes and the yarn or a stitch marker so you can mark where you want to put the eyes and the mouth and of course you're gonna do your virus body not the whole stuff you need to keep an open circle down there as you can see here, I marked where I want to put my eyes and my uh, the mouth. So I usually put the eyes on row on row twelve, or you can just count over here: one, two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So you're gonna put your the eyes on the line number 12 from the start you just count 12 and then you put the eyes usually I keep 12 stitches so I put the first eye count 11 and then I put the other eye so there is 12 stitches here and then I add the mouth just not right under here I skip these two stitches and these two stitches and then I keep 10 stitches for the mouth so for the first half five, 5 stitches and for the second half 5 stitches so a total of 10 stitches for the mouth and 12 for the eyes so let me show you over here how I I'm, going, I'm going to do it so I, in this model I just crocheted the body and then I marked where I want to put the eyes so I just counted 12 from the top one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So here where I want to put the eyes. I added the first one over here and then I just counted eleven until I added twelve in the twelve stitches, the second eye. I skipped these two stitches under the eyes. And then I added my mouth. So I just added the first one here, counted 10 and added the second one. So I'm gonna replace these yarn, little yarn with the eyes and the mouth. So first I'm gonna add the first eye in, in this stitch. Just gonna take this out and put the eye. You can 
¿sí? Then I put fix it from inside, just that just put the eye holder over here and click it to fix it on, on the body. I will do the same thing with the other with the other eye. Just take this out and add the other eye. Make sure that you hear this click so that you make sure that it stays in place and don't pop out. So now we added the eyes. Let's go and add the mouth. Bring your thread. We're gonna take this out and just go from inside and get my needle through this hole. Okay. You need to keep a little thread. And here so now I came from the stitch that I showed you now we're gonna count to five one two three four five again one two three four and five so you're gonna you need it again inside here now we go we will go to the other side here we're gonna take this out and then you can insert your needle in this stitch get your needle out You will count five as well, but you're gonna insert it here anyway. One, two, three, four, five. So now we have two parts of the mouth. But we need two make it a nice smile like this so what I usually do is just in the row below this side here where my needle came out just under it here in this row I'm gonna count two stitches from the left one and two see one two so just right over here one two three one two three I'm gonna get my needle out of the third stitch from the left one two three so after getting your needle out of the third stitch here 
you're gonna put your needle just behind the thread just behind it here don't go inside the body here just behind the thread get your needle see and then we're gonna go and insert the needle in the same stitch that the thread came out from so just insert your needle again in the same stitch and you're gonna have this little small smile in the first half of the thread we're gonna do the same with the second half of the thread so our thread is still inside I'm gonna go to the other side just in the row below the mouth one two three so we're gonna insert our needle again so this is one two and one two three get your needle out and again just go behind your thread get your needle your thread out and then we're gonna go back in the same stitch and in this way we made this beautiful smile to finish I usually go and make a knot from inside One or two, that's okay. And then what I do next is just look for this thread that I used in the first one in the beginning and just add another secure tie or no knot. Just to make sure that the smile stays in place and it won't get out. And then just cut whatever remaining and that's it. Now you have this beautiful smile. So once you have your eyes and mouth ready, now I'm going to show you how to add the other three spikes. We're going to keep a space over here and just add the first spike to the side. You need to keep a space over here so that you can crochet the empty dots. So with your needle you're just gonna sew this spike in place I usually hide any extra yarn just inside the spike. The spikes has two parts. So this is the first part of the spike. And there is the second part of the spike. All the details are in the pattern in the description book uh, in the description box. I'm going to show you how to make this the one in the middle and then the other one or you can just start 
with the side one as well same thing you're gonna take your spike and again on the side you're gonna keep space like about six stitches or so and then you're gonna put the other spike again So we added now the side spikes and we're gonna add the third one and just in the middle here between the, these two. So we added the third spike to the middle row here so we can have something that looks like this. And then you, as I said you're gonna just also sew this part two spikes on the top here at, at the end you're gonna have something that looks like this with the eye the smile and the three spikes in the middle and in the same way you're gonna put the spikes in the distribution I showed you in the previous videos then you're gonna crochet M14 pop stitches and an extra if you want to make it a rattle you can just when you put your stuff here you can just uh, add any rattle you want or you can add even a catnip if you like and you can have this final virus amigurumi here if you have any questions just let me know in the comment section below and you can also follow me on my instagram or twitter at the purple lyric and tag me on any final image of this project you want to share with me thank you and have a good day